weaving friends and welcome to today's video I'm doing something a little bit different today I'm going to be showing you some of my weaving demonstrating some overshot that I'm doing on my table loom at the moment it's just a sampler that I'm having fun with so I just thought that I would give that as a visual and that can be our background while I'm talking about today's actual topic the topic today is why weaving is more important than ever. I was inspired to talk about this topic by Angela Fair. If you don't know Angela, she is a watercolor artist and she is also a, an online course creator and her courses are available over at Teachable just like mine are. I'm also on Angela's email list because I think she's a really smart business person and she's also very inspiring so I like to follow her emails and she sent out an email recently with the title does art matter during a pandemic five reasons why it's more important than ever and this got me thinking about weaving because of course weaving is a type of art and I thought that Angela's topic was very applicable to weaving as well so that's what we're going to talk about today today's video is sponsored by the online weaving school where you will find classes for weavers of all levels and all different types you can purchase single classes or memberships. There are four different types of memberships. And when you purchase a membership, you also get to join the online weaving community. If you've never visited the weaving school, there are free classes available as well. So pop over and check that out today. The link will be in the description box down below. All right, so as I mentioned, the discussion today is around the topic why weaving is more important than ever. As we all know, this has been a really bizarre, challenging, not so nice in a lot of ways and full of opportunities in other ways. It's certainly been a year that I think we will all remember and that will go down in history as fairly unprecedented. But I've jotted down some points as to why I think weaving is more important than ever. And I'm just going to go through them. They're not in order of importance or relevance. They're just in random order. So the first point is that weaving is a usable and tradable skill. Now, if God forbid things were to get even worse than they are right now, we've already seen food shortages this year and particularly for food staples like flour, rice, pasta, those kind of things have been hard to get or actually impossible to get at times that they've just been cleared off the supermarket shelves altogether. So if we were to have shortages of other types, for example, clothing, you know, our basic cloth, weaving becomes a very important skill because we can, as weavers, we can make our own cloth and we can make our own clothes, linens, items out of that cloth also if it becomes hard to purchase certain things then we have a skill that is tradable we can barter we can sell basically we can make something with our hands that can can then become a commodity if it needs to be my next point as to why weaving is more important than ever is to be able to add beauty to a world that is let's face it often ugly through weaving we can add a little bit of beauty to the world through making unique things through gifting people with our hand woven pieces or through selling them getting them out there into the world so our weaving can be a positive force and bring happiness to people in a variety of ways I know that during this pandemic, a lot of weavers have been weaving gifts for people, very personal and thoughtful gifts that would definitely make a difference to people. And you might remember back when the pandemic was sort of in its new stages that I put out the Wash Your Hands Towels, a free project. Um, I'll give the links to that down below as well. But a lot of people took up that class and used it for good. So they used it to make towels either for themselves to cheer up their own homes and put something pretty and functional into their own homes 
or for gifts as others. And I know a lot of people are still using that class right now to make Christmas gifts for people. So that's one small example of how we can use our weaving to add a little bit of beauty to the world. The world is crazy in a lot of ways. The world is very noisy, it's not stable, it's upended, and there's just so much happening at once. A lot of us have found ourselves this year needing peace and needing to find new ways to instill that peace within ourselves and within our families and within our homes. So weaving can bring us that peace in a variety of ways. It gives us purpose. There are just so many new weavers this year who have found real purpose in taking up weaving and many of them have wanted to take up weaving for a long time and haven't done it because of work commitments, family commitments, life commitments and those commitments have been greatly decreased this year and people have been able to follow their interests more and also weavers who have been weaving for a long time continue to find purpose or have found renewed purpose in what they do. Weaving gives us something to really focus on that takes us away from whatever else is happening in the world. Obviously it can be quite destructive to just be immersed in the mainstream media and in events that are happening around us all the time need something to take us away from all of that and just focus on what we're doing with our hands and calculating yarn and planning projects and making them happen. That focus is a really positive focus and we can get fully immersed in what we're doing and not forget about what is happening around us because we can't forget and it's a lot of things that are happening are really important for us to know but it gives us a reprieve and lets us focus our energies on something else that is that charges us up rather than runs us down and makes us feel full rather than constantly emptying us out so that brings me to the next point about well-being the ways in which weaving can contribute to our general well-being, well, it gives us an avenue to express our creativity and that is really important. I think everyone needs to express creativity in some way and it doesn't have to be in the typical ways of art, um, crafting, weaving. It can be in all kinds of ways, gardening, exercise, writing, there are just so many different ways we can express ourselves. Another way that weaving can contribute to our well-being is, is a sense of achievement and fulfillment that we can get from making something from scratch. And then another really important thing is to prove to yourself that you can achieve something. I've seen a lot of new weavers this year and I think a lot of people are surprised by themselves to find that they're more capable than they thought that they thought they were, they're more creative than they thought they were, and that if you have the desire and the passion for something, you can make it happen. And that can be an extremely positive force in our lives. Weaving is something that you can control. There are so many things happening that are way out of our control. We can't do anything about them except hope and pray. But in weaving, we can control that. We can plan projects, we can select the colors and the yarn, the pattern. We can decide what the project is going to be used for at the end. And then we can actually implement it and weave it, and take it through all the steps to the very end process. It's your project and external factors can't change that. 
So that is a really good thing for us at the moment. It's really important at this time to be a positive and inspirational force for others. Now, we're not always going to feel positive or feel like inspiring other people. But the thing about inspiration is it's contagious. So I, I personally definitely do not feel positive a lot of the time. But I find that if I can do something positive to inspire somebody else, it's like wildfire. It just takes off. And then that comes back to me as more inspiration and more positivity. We need to show other people that even though things are not necessarily feeling so positive, we don't just stop living and stop learning and curl up on the couch and watch TV all day. That no matter what is happening externally, we can still be productive, make beautiful things, help other people and not give up. The last point I want to make about why weaving is more important than ever is because it gives us a connection with other people. And I've definitely realized this over the past year more than ever, that even though I'm a huge introvert and I consider myself the kind of person who doesn't really need other people in the way that some do, the connections that I have formed with people this year have been huge. They've been really important to me and they've been equally important to the people that I've connected with. So when we can connect with people over a specific topic, other differences can melt away. You might notice that on places like Facebook groups, when you have a group that is about a specific topic, if someone tries to introduce another topic, it can be absolute mayhem. So if you have, for example, a weaving group and people start to share their political views or go off topic about something else, the group can really fall apart very quickly. But when we have a group that is really focused on weaving you'll, or on a specific topic, you'll notice that people of all different backgrounds, beliefs, nationalities can come together and talk about the topic and share what they're doing with that topic and ask questions and have all different sorts of discussions. And you get this melting pot of people who you would never normally see them thrown together in one place and it just wouldn't work. But because there is a specific topic and everyone sticks to that topic, it becomes a very positive, helpful group. And then within those kind of groups, other connections can be made on a more personal level and friendships can be formed outside of the group, but outside of Facebook groups and all of that. I think I've learned a lot about people this year and about our basic needs as humans, that when connections are made, they are important, they're meaningful. And especially in times of lockdown, when there are people who may be living on their own. And so connecting with others has become really important to me. And in these times, online connection has become more important than ever because it's so difficult to have physical face-to-face -face connections in so many parts of the world at the moment. So those are my thoughts. Now I wanna pass it over to you and get your thoughts. Why do you think weaving is more important than ever? Or how has weaving become very important to you this year? Or even what has weaving done for you this year? Whether you are a seasoned weaver, whether you have just taken it up this year or last year or recently, why is it so important to you and why especially now more than ever. I'd love to hear from you in the comments about this. 
Thank you all for listening today. If you liked this video, please remember to like it, subscribe to my channel. It makes a huge difference to me and I really appreciate it. I hope you're doing really well and getting lots of beautiful weaving out there into the world. Until next time, happy weaving. Thank you.